late at night and I was bored. So this happened. So the first thing I got was a beanie. I've been really into beanies for some reason and I have a red one from Topshop and a black one from Middle Island and I just thought I needed a grey one in my life. So I got this one from ASOS and actually it's quite tight. I think I've just got a big head but it's got a pom pom on the top and why is it so tight? Is my head really that big? And now I've just ruined my hair for the rest of the video. Great. I normally do not share underwear in hauls because it's quite a private thing. But I think this is more like a fashion bra rather than a actual like underwear bra bra. So it's basically a bra with lots of black straps and it's a lacy number like this. And I'm not going to try this on for you because of obvious reasons but I'll put in a picture of what it looks like on the model on the website yeah and I think this will be cool underneath vest tops and t-shirts especially when it gets a little bit warmer and I can start wearing stuff like that I also got a shirt I actually got a couple of shirts because I feel like I don't have enough tops I have a lot of like jeans and trousers and shorts and skirts and whatnot but I don't have enough tops so I got this Actually this is gorgeous, it's such a gorgeous colour, better than I expected. It's like a navy shirt with white top stitching on and it just looks like this. It's actually really nice, the quality feels a lot more expensive than what it was and I'm looking forward to wearing that. I got this sweater and this was actually in the sale, I think it was like £22 so I thought that's quite a good deal and it's not a plain sweater because it has these details on the side, it's basically like a laced up detailing and it has it on um, both sides so it looks like that. I actually got it a size up, I got it in a size 10 but now I'm thinking it might be a little bit too big. I got it in a size 10 because I wanted it to look baggier but I think it might just look a little bit too baggy right now because it kind of looks big. I got another shirt and this is actually by New Look. Um, I saw it on the website and it was only like £15 or something so I thought I'd take it. It's basically a striped shirt but it has different stripes. So this one has a thick stripe and this side has a thin pin stripe. So I thought that would be quite a cool casual shirt but quite dressy as well I guess I can dress up and another shirt can you tell I'm really liking shirts um, is a denim shirt I do not have a denim shirt I had a maternity denim shirt but obviously I'm not wearing that anymore so I thought I'd just pick up a shirt and have it as kind of like a wardrobe staple piece and sometimes if I'm wearing quite a plain t-shirt then I can just wear it openly and have it as a cardigan so I got this dark wash denim shirt it's actually a lot darker than I thought it would be it looks a bit, little bit lighter on the picture um, on the website but yeah a denim shirt the last piece of clothing is a pair of collops from Mango these were in the sale so these were like £14 so that's quite a good bargain kind of like a tailored clots it's not like a linen or a casual one these are more these are more dressy and tailored which I kind of liked um, I think it would look nice with like a shirt that I just bought and maybe some like heels so yeah some black clots I also got two items of jewelry and I really like how ASOS gives you Boxes, even though the jewellery isn't that expensive they still give you a box which I think is quite a nice touch so I got this ring it's a sterling silver ring and it's really dainty and really thin and it's just this gold ring that you know has this square detail on and I'll do a close-up for you and then I also got a choker it's a really thin choker um, a gold one and it's got like a hexagon on and yeah it just looks like this I'm running into like dainty gold jewelry right now if I'm wearing silver jewelry I like it quite like big but then if I'm wearing gold jewelry I like it quite dainty and you know quite minimal so that's quite a nice little piece and this was like five pounds the ring was eight pounds so it's not 
that expensive at all. Last but not least, I got a NYX Wonder Pencil. It's kind of like a concealer pencil. And what I got this for is when I'm wearing lipstick, I normally do the concealer thing around my lips especially if I'm wearing like a bold colour just to tidy it up and make it look really nice and neat but sometimes it can look so obvious when you've got like a big chunk of concealer all the way around your lips and then you have to spend time blending it out to make it look natural and so I thought I'd just get a pencil you know go around the entire lip really quickly and just blend it in ra rather than having a big you know block of concealer to blend in and I think this will be nice underneath the brow as well just to tidy up the brow shape and you know it's just a lot easier than using liquid so I thought that would be good and it was only £4 as well so yeah I'll let you guys know how I get on with that I wish I bought more but then sometimes when I go into ASOS I'm like yeah 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 there's like so many cool things and there's a lot to choose from and then when I start going through everything I'm just like you know what this is too much and I just end up not buying anything but I'm actually glad that I bought some things this time just not as much as I wanted to I wanted to buy like some new spring gear but because it's been raining so much in London I feel like it's not even a time to start buying spring like gear yet so I'm gonna wait that out and see what happens with the weather but anyways I'm just rambling so I'll see you in my next video bye guys that's how it works and you wanna put these behind your ears so that the mask doesn't you know slip and slide I'm gonna pop my 